got some breads here. And as you can see, we got some um, indents in the midsole. So I'm gonna show you how to get rid of that, like little dents. Now, we got some Gorilla Glue, 220 sandpaper, and some baking soda. I only recommend this in like, um, let me get that off of here, like non-stressful areas. Like this isn't in a bad spot, if you can see this little dent right here. Okay, so as long as it's not in a, a very stressful area, you can use this method. We're gonna just fill that in with our Gorilla Glue. I'm gonna dump the baking soda on top. Okay, like so. I'm gonna get something to press so I don't use my hand. Press that in there. Okay. Blow it off, or you know, dust it off. And now we have that little dent filled in. Just get your sandpaper, sand that down. And like I said, this is for like non-stressful areas. It's not gonna be a lot of stress in this area and it's not really that deep. So it's you, you, you'll be fine, like you can get away with doing this. I wouldn't do this in an area where you're gonna get a lot of like bending and a lot of like um, where it was smashed at or something like that really, really, really heavily. But little stuff like this, like you're good. time we got two right here I'll put in the glue some gorilla glue baking soda now we're gonna move quick smash it down okay Dust it off, and now we got those two little spots. You can see how sturdy it is. I can still bend and push, okay? You can still, but these are very, like I said, they're very sturdy, so you don't have to worry about that too much. Get the sandpaper. it put a little bit more so you like it just keep sanding and you're good okay you can save yourself a little bit of stress with the sanding just put it in some needle nose pliers like so and sand right in there <laughs> You can see that there. Um, they ask if it's bendable or is it flexible. When, once you do that, yes it is. Like I said, it was not, the area that I'm putting it in, it's not too deep and it's not in a bad spot. You know what I'm saying? It's not where I, you know, areas over here or at the front where the, the thing is really bending, you know. This is for like static, static areas. You got a little hole, you got a little gash, a little dot like that. Put your baking soda over the top, smash it down. Got your little dot right there. Okay. And sand till smooth. Right, you 
go. We feel it in your little dents. It's a little chip right here. I also will fill that with paint too, I'll do that. But if I'm moving quick, I use the Gorilla, Gorilla Glue, Sandpaper, and Baking Soda Method. Hey, my name is Footprints, and again, I'd like to thank you for watching. So here's a little bit about me. I specialize in re-glues and patent leather repairs, and I also can fix the hole in the front of a toe box for like Yeezy 350s or on the side as well. I have a special suede and new buck renewal powder and sealer that's available. And I also do online live classes. I have eBooks available, PDFs, and a whole lot more. So stay tuned and thank you again.